Yo, 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 yo. What up, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Lazy Gamer, and I'm back. I'm back. Relax, relax, y'all. I was coming. I was coming. Pause. I'm back, though. I'm back, though, man. Let's get to it, man. I ain't gonna talk y'all head off. I was not gonna stream today, y'all. I was not gonna do it. I was gonna do it. Then I thought about it. And then I decided to do it. So, that's that's why I'm here. I just, I decided to do it. Hold on. Y'all can hear me? Cause my mic doing a whole bunch of weird shit, but it'd be like that though. Uh I'm not fighting that nigga. Who's that nigga on that nag? Don't wanna fight boss, I'm not gonna lie. Dog, what's today? Tuesday? Bro, it feel like I don't know. Ain't no day worse than Monday, but it feel worse than Monday. Oh my god. What's up with all these nineties? These ninety niggas, man. Who who is these niggas on that neck? Hey y'all, if y'all new to the channel, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, man. Y'all see we out here grinding, bro. I I done lost kind of how many streams I done made. I have no clue. No clue. I think the video comes at like over fourteen hundred at this point. I figured if I got one sub per video, I'd be monetized by now. But that's not how it works. It's not how it works over here, man. You just got to do it. You know, tell me how long you have to do it. And a thousand ain't even the end goal. That's just like so I can get donations and probably get like a sponsor or get a commercial or something on this stream or some shit. Who knows? That's just one of the goals. The watch hour is more important. So, fuck the subs, man. Watch these shits, bro. Watch these shits, bro. Watch these videos, man. If you ain't watch the old stuff, go back and watch those, too. Because I think I done, I, I've done refined myself. Because I used to talk super crazy. Super crazy. I'm a nice guy now. I'm the nicest. I be so nice to people. Like, you can do it, Craig. Just get up. Get up, Craig. I be telling them, get up. They can do it. Giving them pointers. They don't be listening, though. That That's annoying. They definitely don't be listening to me, though. They need to start. I'm like, that's not going to work, bro. Nope, they keep going. Come on, bro. I don't, I don't know what that shit is, bro. Man, I be trying, man. I be on this motherfucker every day. Every day. Every day I wear blue and red every day. Every day I wear blue and red. Because I'm 50 Tyson. See, that's OG YouTube. I don't know if y'all know about... I don't know if y'all know about 50 Tyson. What up, Crime Dev Gaming? What's up, my boy? What up, Jay Allen? What up? What's your... <clears throat> oh, I appreciate you, man. I appreciate the support, man. Uh, it's gonna be rough on these YouTube streets, bro. I'm thinking about getting some uh some corn stars just to sit behind me and do stuff, you know, so I can get the attention, the attention grabbing. You know what I'm saying? Get some shorties behind me. I'm not fighting, boss. I know you about to spam the shit on me, cause. And I'm trying to, man. I don't think I'm going to get a streak. Probably get like a fiver. A fiver. If I get a fiver, I'm going to end the stream. I ain't going to lie. Five, five fights. Five wins. That's good. So I could distract myself from these bets, man. I think LeBron going to come through, man. It's a playoff game. Definitely need Brian Brown to come through. I think Draymond Green going to have a good game, too. I done put some money on down. I need a return on investment, man. I need a ROI. ASAP. If y'all not gambling, don't start. Please don't. Because, yeah. It's it's a bad habit to have. Bad habit to have. I've been on a little streak, though. I ain't gonna lie. Been on a little streak. So, I'm feeling kind of lucky. So, <sighs> wish me luck. 
Mm. I need some gas money on. Cause gas like almost three fifty, right? And I just filled up. That was almost like sixty some bucks. That hurt. I need some of that money on back. Man, he could have fought me, cuz. What's up with the server, y'all? I don't think we're gonna get a streak. I'll be lucky if I get a fight. I gotta keep the stream rolling. I gotta keep talking to my damn self. I'm I'm responding as if y'all talking to me, but I'm talking to myself. Streaming make you a little bit crazy. I ain't gonna lie to you. Make you a little bit crazy. Bro, we could have fought, bro. Why is he running from me, bro? We just gonna match up again because I'm just gonna keep pressing the button real fast. Now I'm gonna talk to you. <clears throat> Damn, y'all. Y'all niggas 90s in the bug, bro. We can't box, bro. We're not cool. Never fight a fighter that's ranked 90. And named after a real fucking boxer, bro. Jerron Ennis. Dude, think he boots, man. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a swell buddy face up, bro. Quit playing. He think he boots for real. He go get on my damn nerves. Damn, I'm almost, I'm almost, I almost won three grand. Where's that money, though? I I do not have none of that. <clears throat> yeah. I mean, I'm leaving these motherfuckers, too. I'm not fighting no 91. I'm, I'm not fighting no 90s. I ain't about to be sweating today. Not about to be sweating today. Because all they got too much shit maxed out. Even though I'm 86, I think I could take a nigga. Pause. <laughs> I think I, I don't know. I think I could keep up, but that's that's a lot of point difference. That's that's a lot. Five, yeah, I can't do five, especially top five. Like it was like 80, 86 and I was like eighty one. I fought a couple of those fights. I actually won a couple too though, but not ninety, man. That shit crazy. I know you got one punch on at least two punches. At least two punches you want punch on. Probably an uppercut in the straight. Or you just go come out straight and me to death. Alright, let's just go to middleweight. See, I don't even see I don't even like playing middleweight because I don't even care. Alright, one more time. One more time. I know it's somebody. Come on, come on. Come on, bruh. <sighs> All these 90 niggas on the server right now. All right, fuck it. I'm going to fight whoever come up. These don't count. This is just filler. This is filler until lightweight fill up. I'm going to try to win them, though. See, we the same nigga. We might as well get it on. He go back out. He don't get no better than this, boss. Alright, got one. Damn. But he did not want to scrap. Where they do it bigger and better than any other city when it comes to the big time fights. We're at the Thomas and Mack Center for a much anticipated main event. Ten rounds, middleweights going at it. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what I can do. I haven't played with this fighter in a minute. He a lot slower. Wish I had a little bit more speed, but he could. He definitely a power puncher. And I think he an outside. No, I think he a boxer puncher too, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I guess he's trying to see my record. Look on their face. They know they put the work in, and you can see how confident they are for the battle that lies ahead. He's just a bigger version of the lightweight fighter. I made him exactly the same. As far as appearance. What's up, Miss Number One? How you doing, young lady? Now they do as round one is underway. 
The bully's getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Now committing to that jab, straight hand, and it works out. The bully's got a way of just getting away from that punch. Teddy, what role can the fans play on the fighters, the atmosphere of the arena, when they know there's two guys meeting up that can bang? An immature fighter, a less experienced fighter, can get caught up. He can try to satisfy the audience. That's a quick way to be going to the shower earlier than you wanted to. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by the bully. Tony's defense did a good job there, able to avoid that punch. Well placed, well timed combo up top. He got hit, but he sends it right back. Nice work. Halfway through round number one. Committing well now to that left hand over the top. Tony's swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That punch was nowhere near his opponent. Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. Nice strike after catching one by the bully. Nice combination, throwing more than one. Both scored there. He definitely got more speed than me, though. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Tony's missing the mark by a mile. That just was nowhere to be found. All right. End of the round is upon us. <clears throat> and if the next round holds Man, up, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. No, we will be because both Definitely seen the uptick in the watch hours. Them the defense hardest things to get, bro. Offense. Watch hours be crazy. Right. Definitely be crazy. Right. I don't be wanting to show like me out in the streets and shit because that's unnecessary. I just want to keep my shit kind of focused on like game stuff, outside stuff. It's not even. I, I feel weird. I feel weird having my camera out, having my phone out in general. Not that I'm doing nothing crazy or nothing, but I just don't like it. That's just not my thing. I'm like, why are you streaming? I don't know. Let me be selectively antisocial type shit. I ain't even antisocial. I'm just not overly social, man. Like social media social. Like person to person, I'm social as shit. Why is he dodging my hook, though? Tony's doing what he does. He shit out my hook. I want to hit him with it. He keep pulling back. Punches and punches. All right, other foot then. Damn. Bitch hard to hit. The bully's done a good job there. Offensively my straight one punch, bro. He should have been hit. down a long time ago. Lands flush with the combination upstairs. Okay, so how he missed that punch and then throw a combo and hit me. I ain't get a counter or nothing. Combo lands upstairs. What a big Told you. Oh, a good straight. Oh, it should have been oh, that should have been a one punch. Don't tell you to draw a straight line. That was a straight line. Right to the chin. Shit, 24-7. Not even one. Not one seven. You know what I'm saying? Two, At all. Like, I don't even like other people with cameras, man. That get to annoy me. I see a camera. I kind of just go ahead and find me a nice corner to go in. Yeah, we're getting a peek right now. Like, why is you recording me, G? I just want to chill. The bully's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. It'd be like that, though. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by the bully. Tony's doing well here with that two punch combination. He got hit right there, but he also Bruh. gave one. Solid he a lot of power shots. Not able to land the headshot. 
End of the round. <coughs> so he scores the knockdown and now heads back to his corner. Teddy, do you ever have to calm a guy All right, so it's not, a, it's not, see? The way you even frame that is off. It's not a, it's not a J. Cole Kendrick beat. That, most of that this that this verse was for Drake. It's really a Drake and Kendrick beat. What I think about him apologizing? Shit, he fuck with K. Dot. Shit, he ain't want to diss him. So, you see how nasty is getting already. I think he did what he wanted. Did the right thing. Cause shit, he came back with a whole song. He only had two bars for J. Cole, if that. There ain't no diss for him to say he nah. Ain't no big three. It's a big me. Meaning he the best. That ain't a diss, cause they both, everybody been saying they the best, so I don't see that as a diss. I don't mind it, but you know, some people just want to see it. I always knew it was gonna be Drake and Kendrick if anybody was if anybody was gonna be beefing, it was gonna be Drake and Kendrick. They've been beefing since 2016. So, they've been serving each other. I'm like, both y'all ain't saying no names yet, so I would have been said, fuck you, nigga. How about that? Another right hand. Took a shot. Now he gives a left. There's that southpaw jab in the left hand. Bruh. Uh, that was two pop. Three power shots, bro. He eating them. Bro, his chin is crazy. His chin is crazy. <laughs> his chin is insane, bro. I got one punch, bro. Why he ain't he ain't wrong? Why he ain't one punch by now? I got one punch to the body too. And this round comes to an end. This guy is beating. If you throw three or four punches in a row, you turn this around. But you have to let it go. Yeah. It'd be like that. People just be doing shit for content. I'm like, I'm not content, G. Let me enjoy this bottle, man. Relax. But yeah, people don't give a fuck. People pretty much just doing anything at this point. I don't want to do anything. That's a razor sharp uppercut by the bully. Very good work on the inside with the uppercut. Now, if you're standing opposite that right there, Teddy, what do you have to do to stop it? Well, first of all, you have to understand and recognize that's a punch you should be aware of in close because there's only a few punches. You're in real close. There's not bro, why is he still up, bro? Somebody explain that to me. First of all, and so many head on the side, power bro. shots I'm hitting him with. The bully's punch is far off the target. Good looking right hand after he got hit. that wants to do just that find the target get the combination working land both punches Halfway let me say it is Stan I little Stan real fast at this fight he be throwing bombs Bro, how many straights? Alright, I ain't gonna throw it no more. I'm good. 
Tony's lack of defense, especially when it comes with just getting away from that right hand, is really costing him a lot. I don't think in like two, in two more generations, I don't think it's going to be like no more skilled trades, people. No more. Everybody's going to be trying to be on the internet. Tony's work in training camp is now paying off. Do you see the accuracy and the effectiveness with that combination? <clears throat> Beautiful. Beautiful. Drake and Future. I want another round. Yeah, that too. I know they got a little squabble going on over a little honey dip. It wasn't this and cold, bro. It was Everything besides the big meat line was Drake. So how you dissing cold with the verse? On older songs? Nah. Well, okay. Maybe. 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 I'll give you that. They subbing, though. That That's what they been doing. But I don't think there's no real beef with them. I just think niggas just keep saying I'm the best, I'm the best. But them going back and forth ain't going to prove who the best. Because whoever like whoever go still think they the best. <laughs> really don't matter at that point. And the beef wouldn't even decide who better between the two anyway. They both lyricists, so the only way you can really decide who the best if they go verse for verse, not against each other. Y'all get on the song, and whoever got the best verse go dictate who's better. But that was three power shots he just ate. Clean shot with the right. The bully's showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. Attaboy. Keep swinging, baby. Still plenty of time to work here in round number five. A minute and a half to go. Bro, he not taking damage, bro. <laughs> he can't be. He can't be. I done rocked his ass with about 50 power shots already. <laughs> not my jab stunned him. Not my jab. Man, that's what I'm saying. If they trying to... Man, look. I don't respect this shit. So y'all niggas really gonna try to jump? Is this the first rap beef jumping? Is they jumping Drake right now? Let me find out. I don't respect it. Because y'all niggas... Y'all niggas ain't want no one-on-one. Y'all waited on the nigga to swing. Now y'all jumping him. That's crazy. I don't respect it. Now, what if he flame all y'all? And Drake is the wrong person to do a diss track to because he know how to make his shit snappy, bro. It's going to hit different. It might not be as lyrically complex, but shit be snappy. I ain't going to lie. I wouldn't, I wouldn't come at I would have picked a different way to come at that. I ain't going to lie to you. And he petty, too. It's going to make it worse. Digs in with a good solid uppercut after taking a shot. So he takes a between Facts. They jump in my boy. I don't like that, bro. That make me root for him. <laughs> that make me root for Drizzy. At that point, I'm rooting for him. Because why y'all jumping him, bro? That's kind of weak to me, bro. Why y'all jumping my boy? Now Rick Ross jumping out the window. They gassing that little weak ass shit he put out. That shit was ass. Good filler bars. It sounds like a song. And at the end, he talking shit. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his own. Oh, sending more than one at him now. The I don't even got to fight head. boss back. Some fine fundamentals. Good counter punch. Nice mousetrap. They let Stupid him in bitch. Three. He didn't use cheese. He used distance. The boy's showing you what... And now I ain't mean to do that. I ain't mean to do that, boss. Take a second. You got some damage on you. All right. There you go. We good. Come on. I ain't trying to headbutt this. He takes a shot. 
and then commits to giving one right back. Tony's a seasoned pro, and old pros tend to fall into the same pattern. Nothing has changed with him stylistically since he's been knocked down in this fight. Well, that falls right into that pattern or that his water short. where old dogs can't be taught new tricks. Well, right now, he's going to have to come up with a trick or two, maybe, to survive this moment. The bully's really making some boxing purists out there put a smile on their face because his defense has been stellar. He's so fundamentally sound. Yeah, well, that's why he always goes rounds, and that's why people think he has an iron chin. I don't know if he has an iron chin because the chin never gets touched. He's a guy that's always going rounds because his defense is so good. He gets off with a combination up top. All right, let me stop for you one two me to death. Final ten seconds of the six. Oh, he got that. Fuck it. And that's the end of round six. The bully's in position right now to really bring home a good victory. He's up on the punch stats. He's up on your scorecard. This is his fight. Yeah, we just hope that the judges, and you never know that. That's one thing that sometimes can really disappoint you. This Man, Drake been popping shit since 2019, man. <laughs> man. I don't like the niggas he helped, the ones, the ones that's trying to beef with him, though. Well, you can beef with me, but y'all ain't about to jump me, bro. You should have said something, said something before you took that stem. And I been thought fucking Future fell off. I ain't listened to Future since 56 nights, so I don't know how long ago that was. Yeah, Once I found out that nigga don't do none of them drugs he be rapping about, hell no. Selling y'all niggas that shit, bro. Even I like it. it's not like I do drugs though. Not like I do drugs though. I have to rock, rock his ass. Not that I was listening to him and doing the drugs. But I'm just saying, once I figured that out, I'm like, oh, buddy out here just saying shit, huh? Can't fuck with future. Tony's still in a tough spot here. Same old ass slow style. I'm good. And I'm not so sure that he can grab. So what you gotta do now if you're training. I mean Well, I don't know how deep it is. You know what I'm saying? I just ain't wanna I just ain't want Cole, well, I wouldn't have minded if Cole went back and forth with him. But Cole didn't feel right about it, so I, I, I respect him staying true to what he want to do. K-Dot, I just feel like all he do is rap, call niggas out, and disappear for a couple of years. That's all I really feel like, though. He be spitting, though. But, yeah, I need more music output from the boy. It took nine rounds. What was that nine rounds? Oh, six. He scores the knockout here tonight. Now that's how you end a fight right there. Yes, but he was now you got outside niggas like Wack 100 talking about niggas yeah, can't come to California. That that's the bullshit I don't even like. So it ain't even about them at that point. Y'all, everybody trying to hop in it at this point. I don't like that. If it could stay just music, I don't give a fuck. It's that other shit. There's gonna be some other shit, but shit. Drake got the money on. So shit, it is what it is. Whatever they want to do, I guess they go do it. I'm gonna be watching though. Don't get me wrong. I I was looking all day for. I thought something was gonna drop today. I was looking. Man, that TikTok shit. Ain't no money in that, bro. <clears throat> Ain't no money in that TikTok music shit, bro. Like. My whole thing is, like, where do these motherfuckers be getting the dances from? It's like the song come out with a dance. So who they give, like, I feel like they giving the song to, like, a, a big creator. And they come up with a dance for it and they drop it. Because I always wonder, like, who's the first person to do the song with the dance? Where did, where did that shit come from? Like, is they giving it to choreographers? That's TikTokers? I don't know. And they all got the little same dumbass dances, bro. 
Ain't no originality in it, man. When I was a kid, you used to, you can't do a dance somebody else just did. You have to come up, you have to do a different dance, bro. You couldn't do the same thing. Shit. Nah, it's just little routines and shit. And motherfuckers be doing that shit in the club. <laughs> what is you doing? We don't dance in here. Sit your ass down, bro. They used to be doing TikToks in the club. That's how I knew my club days was over. And we welcome you to the Royal oh. Theater here in London, England. For a much anticipated main event. When that Uzi Vert shit dropped, my club days was over. We are looking forward to this fight, especially after seeing. All niggas slapping their hips in that motherfucker. Oh, I did not mean to fight this nigga. Here's the first. Oh, shit. I did not mean to take this fight, y'all. Streak is no streak, y'all. Ain't, ain't gonna be no streak. Look at this nigga. I'm gonna fight him, though. Able to cover up that gut. Good step back, counter punch there. Beautiful. Bro, I ain't getting affected by none of them punches, bro. He's still punching through. Sublime skill right now with that two punch combo. Wow, is he defensively sound? That is a sharp uppercut by Bam Bam. Halfway through this round here. Scores with the combo to the head. Bam Bam's way off the mark. That punch didn't have a chance. That was a power. Nice block. I think I won that round. Last ten seconds of this first round. Is able to land at a good connect percentage. Look at the punch stats. This is it. You gotta make the fight right now. <clears throat> well, people did respond. People did. Throw more punch jab. Uh, well, who, who responded? Big Creek? I want you to do uh, Damn, who else responded? I think Meek responded too. He wasn't for real though. Big Sean re responded for real. People did respond. He just really wanted Drake to, honestly. Everybody really knew it was for Drake. Even Drake knew it was for him. He said it wasn't real though. That wasn't enough for him to go. Bro, what is but well, come on. Nice combination. Landing more than one. Both were able to score. Bang. has got to deal with a cut on his cheek right now. The good news is it's below the eye, but still, it could get nasty as the fight progresses. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Very nice defensive guard there. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Bam Bam. Well struck. I'm whooping his ass. He way better than me as far as his fighter is. He just a bad player. He just a bad player overall. Getting my shit in. My bad, y'all. If I, if I don't read the chat to the end of this round. Oh, and he Damn, he caught me with a straight. Hand. 
Good return fire that time. Bam Bam landed a good Dumb bitch. combination. Dumb bitch. Ooh. Dumb. Ooh. Punch. Damn. Oh, we good. We good. Just 10 seconds to go here in the second round. I think I won that round, too. <clears throat> Whew, I think I got that round. His commitment to being judicious and effective really worked out well there. The punch that's proven. Keep your hands moving. Keep busy. Facts. That's what I'm saying. It's weird as hell. And these songs be trash. They really just clip like a, a little portion out of them. When you get the whole song, that should be should be trash, man. Like all color shit was trash, except for the girls' player one. I, that one was a little bop. I kind of liked it that one. But that's just because it had that old school sample in it, though. Banks is in a good rhythm defensively here. Teddy, what is that? A credit to his ability to anticipate? You know, also it's the teaching. Let's give the trainers credit. Of course, let's give his background of the amateurs credit, but he learned how to get away from punches. This is this is the week, bro. Was taught to him. I'm just saying my punches is shit. Picky. Punch. Can't knock him out. Stupid bitch. <laughs> Too bad it was a jab. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Trying to go downstairs, but off target. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. See him timing that double jab to the head. <laughs> Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. Comes right back with a shot of his own. Bam Bam's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Good defense upstairs to stay away. Let's from see these cards. God damn. Alright. <clears throat> Throw the uppercut with everything. Go a little bit slow in there. Throw the uppercut, then the left hook to the head. You gotta you gotta dig in. You gotta start somewhere with miss number one. Well, look, I get off work. I take a little Jeremy, rest break Jeremy, on the couch for like 15 minutes. Jab your way, okay? I go switch my shirt and come sit my ass down. Stream. Yeah. I we, we all don't got time. We got to lock in. We got to get it done. If we don't start, we ain't going to do it. Uh, I don't know, King. I think you can use... I, I think you have to play Legacy Mode. You gotta create one in uh, OWC. Yeah, he actually beat me that round. I, mean, I was missing a couple shots. Counter punching. You got a guy coming at you. No better way than to change his mind. Make him miss. Make him pay. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Bam Bam's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Here's a moment here as you see the step back counter punch where you realize this is the sweet science, not just some raw savagery swinging out there. Look at the little subtleties here, Joe. And look how fast he moves. Alright, let me get my health back together. Steps back, makes a miss, and comes right back. His combination punching is working well here. Bam Bam's well off the mark that time. Hey, get out of there. You gotta see that coming, champ. Let's go. You gotta see that. Pace yourself. Pace yourself. You're doing good. Able to block and counter back. Both guys have a lot. 
lot to be proud of with their performances in this round so far, and they still want to give more. What an encore in this final minute. If you were a kid, you would feel that you're on one of those rides at Space Mountain. I mean, it's just extraordinary. Really wanted that uppercut, but just couldn't get it. Accurate counter punch by Banks. Holy cow, look at this. Back and forth they go. There's no stop. Like, my straight just touches head like it's a jab. You're pushed to the break. They are finding out right now. Ain't no counters or nothing. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Bam Bam's landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. <clears throat> we come to the end of this round. Teddy, a round in which maybe a lot of trainers don't like to see because it was a very busy round. For Nigga, I am moving. Well, this shit just what weird. What kind of style, what kind of strength your fighter has, or even what kind of weaknesses. If I had a guy who liked to box, who liked to counter punch i want a guy coming at him not with a lot of tnt in his gloves but coming forward where my guy is well suited he can pick him off a little bit bam bam's doing well here with that two punch combination A tough target there. He gets away from that punch. Bro, come on. How about a return to sender with the left hand? And coming upon the halfway mark of this three minute round. Teddy, when you've been in the corner in your career and you have a charge who is not making a lot of contact, what do you tell him? The first thing I tell him, Joe, is shorten up your punches a little bit. The other thing I tell him is he's making you miss, so you know what? Faint him a little bit. Get a false move out of him. Get a premature move. move. And when he moves, move. then time him. Now you're going to catch him. Bam Bam's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. What? Move it, move it. Final 10 seconds of this fifth round. Oh, he just misses with that head. <clears throat> Fuck. Banks is coming off another <sighs> close and competitive round, but still, Teddy, I think he's slightly down on the scorecard. How the fuck I'm down, man? What do you think, Joe? Even though I love what you think, I landed the more. The key is what he thinks. He, he probably got a higher percentage, that. though. No, he you even shouldn't have that. And a lot of times, a guy Let's see, man. This shit be crazy. He wants to know what he wants to know. He wants to maybe think in his mind that he's ahead. And it's important that somebody gives him the news. That's right. Body shots. Body shots. Dangerous like, how he's still throwing through that? That was a power hook to the body. Comes right back with some offense of his own. Able to cover up along the belt line. Blocks that one. Bam Bam showing that he you was... You see my, how my straight just lands? It's, it's like it's... When he's chest like a jab. It's not doing nothing. Oh, you have to recognize situations. And he understands on the inside... I ain't even rock exactly buddy yet. what you should be doing. When your opponent has his gloves up, there's an opening to split the guard, especially when he's leaning forward. And he's leaning forward just a little bit. Oh, he scores well with the double jab. Body shot, left hand. Halfway through round six. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Bam Bam showing you that sublime skill right now with that two punch combo. You got this one, baby. You got this one all day, all day. Keep moving. Reflex is fast, too. And another right hand comes in. That's it. That's it. Just like that. Just like that. Banks has got a way of just getting away from that punch. He's tired. Yeah, champ, he's tired. Look at him. Come on, man. Get out of there. One, two there. jabs. Ten 
Seconds remaining in this round. Banks is coming through now beautifully. That's the combination punch he wants. To oh my god. Well, as that round comes to an end, it gives us a moment to kind of reflect on this overall fight. It's tough. See, my thoughts are pretty clear cut. This is the kind of fight that just takes on a personality of its own. This is an all-out war. Yeah, this is kind of like watching a guy who's not on a budget. You know, he's spending with both hands. You know, when he goes home, he's gonna have no money in his pockets. And when this fight is over, these guys are gonna have nothing left in the gas tank, and it's probably not going to a decision. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by Banks. Come on, punch, 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 that's it. That's okay, that's all right. Now pay him back. Go pay him back. Bam Bam's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. Blocks that punch. Move your head. Move your head. Halfway through the seventh round. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Bam Bam's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Keep that guard up. Good defensive skill. Now how the fuck you block that? Fires right back at him. That was not well targeted by Bang. Good solid shots with the combo downstairs. He's putting his punches together. The combination upstairs. Took a shot. Now he gives a left. What a great job. He gave one <clears> right back. It's like hitting a cardboard box, bro. Sound like you're moving a box. Round number eight. We look at Teddy's scorecard. He is up on your scorecard. Up around on this bitch. He's been working more. Is it as simple as just keeping that pace up, or does he need to do something more than that? No, no, I think that so far it's about that, but you asked the right question, but he doesn't need to do anything different. Why? Because his opponent is cooperating. His opponent has to do something different. He needs to start chucking back. If that happens, then he's... Bam, bam! Rocked by that punch! Did you see that? He goes Fuck it. down You better time. plug that controller in. I was whooping that ass anyway. <sighs> bam Bam got dropped. I don't give a fuck. He deserved it. It's over. This fight is over. Banks is gunned down yet another I was scared a little bit. I was scared a little bit. all it took. One good shot. Bam Bam's career hits a major. I was doing good. I was on his ass. About his beard coming in, and those doubts were realized. That does it from ringside for Teddy Atlas. I'm Joe Tessitore. Thanks for being with us. No, try hard everywhere on here, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. Head to head, try hard city. They be cheating on there. Don't tell me he quit. Don't tell me he quit out. Don't tell me he quit out. Did he quit out on me? What was my record before that fight, y'all? Let me... I don't know. I definitely was whooping. I was going to win that fight. I was going to win that fight. <clears throat> I wasn't worried about winning. I was just going to outpoint him. Knocking him out wasn't a thing. I beat a 91 over... Was he a 91 or a 90? Shit, I hope so. He probably a mod, man. He's <sighs> holy purge, unholy purge. Come on, man. Fat white man, fight fat white woman. Definitely a troll. He definitely a. Uh... This is he gonna spam me or he a mod? I'm gonna get out of here. Fuck it. Well, I got a chance. 
But uh, yeah, get up on there, bro. Uh, fighting, I don't know. I don't know. I thought EA put out that they was uh canceling all their upcoming games for uh 2025. Hopefully they change their mind because Fight Night is needed. <clears throat> we do not need a new 2K. We do not need another fucking UFC. I'm so tired of seeing UFC. UFC do not need to come out. If they're going to make another UFC, they need to spend at least three to four years developing it. Because UFC 5 is just UFC 4.5. It's 4 point. UFC 4 with an update. That's it. Ain't nothing new about it. It's the same fucking game. Just looks a little faster. But I don't like how many buttons you got to press. Like, why I got to press seven buttons to do a left, right? That's crazy. Not playing that. Not playing that. <sighs> He a mod. I fought him before. Saved myself a, uh, a sweat fest. He ain't about to just spam me out with straights. So I can't block. <clears throat> Not with the straights you can't block. Yes, the straights you cannot block. Unblockable straights, cuz. Damn. Oh, let me check my best. What I'm doing? See, that's what I'm, so look, man, I got to stay focused. Got to be more careful. LeBron got two assists already. My nigga. Let's go, Brian Brian. All right. Herb, okay. All right. Herb Jones, okay. I see you. Come on, let me find out this going to be a sweep. Let me find out this going to be a sweep. I need all the money in. Matter of fact, should I? No, I ain't gonna do that. Cause I get into these bet sprees to where I'm just here. I'm gonna put three, four hundred on that motherfucker. Nah, I'm just thick with my little bets. Bro, what's up with all the 90s on here, bro? Oh, shit. Let's see what I can upgrade. Cause ain't no one here. I ain't fighting no 90s. I ain't coming in unarmed like that. My body hook is devastating, bro. I was fuck him up with that. <sighs> My right body hook, man. I should get this straight down. Like, I just want them all here. All here. And then I could just play with these a little bit. Like, tee, 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 tee. I don't need to jab up. I could probably do my my uh do my body at that point. Upgrade the body at that point. <clears throat> yeah, defense is key in this game, bro. Having a good team. A lot of people don't like to go to the body that head hunt. So that's where I got an advantage. I make you miss a lot of headshots. If you ain't gonna go to my body, then I'm gonna go to yours. <laughs> And then when that slow down, I'm going to start hitting you in your face, cuz. It's just sitting there. I'm going to bink, mink, mink. Nah, 2K, 2K need a break, bro. They come out every year. I know y'all tired of spending all that money on VC on y'all players and shit. What up, Muhammad? So the straight hand full? Nah, not my straight. All right, let's see. That's what I got going on. My straight is not. I don't want to fool them all out. The only thing that's full is my blocking and my uh, chin. I want to get everything here. So I want this here. I want my right hook to the head here. I, I settle for my left hook being like in here. Yeah, no, that's the plan. That's the plan. So I know he's going to show out. I ain't even tripping. He let me know last game against New Orleans that he go have the ball. He had 17 assists. He ain't let nobody dictate this game but him. I need Roy Hachimura to get 19.5 PRA, though. He got it last game. Hopefully, he hitting his shots. Damn, I just shouldn't even took PRA. I should have took points and rebounds because he ain't going to have the ball to get no assists. 
AD, oh, man. All right, one thing I noticed about very good basketball players it's hard for them to play sometimes. Like, they need a reason to play. Like, playing from behind, they'll come back and win. But for some reason, AD got a low motor sometimes, man. He really do. And he be looking for calls too much. Sometimes you just got to play. That, that be really getting him. He'll miss a shot looking for the call. No, you try to finish that shot because the whistle ain't going to already beat her. Even though you are a superstar. And you should get those calls. They're going to start swallowing that whistle, especially when you look. They're going to start swallowing that, cuz. Everybody know that. They done played ball before. What up, Smoke em? What up, my boy? Nice to see you pulling up. Man, I appreciate y'all supporting me, cuz. I feel special, bro. I feel a little special today. <laughs> ah. Nah. Nah. I fuck with y'all. I appreciate y'all for real, for real, though. Y'all just don't know. Y'all don't know. Let me let me put my hands on, buddy. I think I played dude before. Is he the side stepper? He loves popping that jab. I mean, he will target your head and set up everything else off of that punch. Well, he pulls you back a little bit off the jab, and then he fools you a little bit. You know, he's a little bit of a magician, a little sleight of hand. Then he makes you feel like he's going to push you back again, and he'll step back and he'll counter you. But that jab is what makes it all happen. Bro, he got a 69-inch reach. I ain't hitting him. Straight left hand. Uh, he's on the left-hand side of the game. All right, baby. Banks's power has been shown off early on in his fights. Teddy, what effect bro, come on, could bro. his power have early in this fight? Well, if he catches his opponent, it could be an early night. But if he catches his opponent and his opponent survives it, guess what? It could be a long night, fam. Bro, me chasing you is the wrong thing you want me to do. Not a lot to you. I see what you're trying to do. Not gonna work, bro. Tighten up. Let's get it. Had to let that nigga know. I was about to hit him in this shit. You want to lean to my left? Whether or not he moves his head. Now, if he just stands there straight and you're the trend, you better get up on those steps and stop it. He's not right. Nowhere close that punch by Young. He don't want none of this, bro. I'm too accurate right now. <sighs> no, no, I don't need him shooting threes. We need AD in the post, man. He a fucking monster. He just needs to learn to pick his spots better. Like, I don't think they they don't rely on uh D'Angelo Russell enough, man. He can get you 40, bro. Yo, they be trying to win it they self. Let D-Lo run the point. Brian, you could take a break. Go in the corner or something. Let Hachimura and D-Lo, you know, run the pick and roll. Use their athleticism. They make good decisions, too. It ain't like they, well, sometimes D-Lo be having, having a little moment. That's when you come back and get the ball. Opponents thinking, what the heck am I doing? Am I shadow boxing? Because I'm not finding nothing. But I tell you, if I am shadow boxing, that shadow, it has a little bit of a punch. It hit me back. Let's see some more head moves. Let's see some more head moves. Get out of the way. Straight right was lined up, but he missed. Bunches and bunches, combination up top. Oh, and he's got something. 
something for him himself, and it's a left hand. Banks is on the receiving end of a very good counter punch. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. Banks is not just loading up. He's landing combination punches like he did right there. <clears throat> I'm fucking buddy up. I'm on timing with him. He should be out, though. I done hit him with like five more power shakes. The culture of a corner. He only want to come back with them uppercuts. What was always your philosophy in organizing and running a corner? Well, first of all, only one guy could be in charge. That's the trainer. You can't have uh, too many cooks in the kitchen. It has to be organized like anything else. And you have to have calm people. You only have one minute. Maybe by the time the fighter gets back, maybe it's 50 seconds. So you have to be a harsh left hand by Big. Banks is really bringing a lot behind that uppercut. Teddy, how much of a factor is the How is he still up? How is he still up? How is he still up? Quit playing with me, bro. What the fuck? Whooping bro ass. Get your bitch ass up, cuss. <clears throat> Get up, cuss. Let me let me let me check let me check again. See this this that's why I play the game around this time too. Keep me off that phone. I'll be checking them bits every five minutes. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Banks' combination punching is working well here. Now nah, I was trying to hit him with that counter three times. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, gave him the left shoulder, and then gave him the right hand. Listen, everybody likes to see a great knockout shot to the chin. But truth be told, at this stage of a fight, the foundation for winning comes by going downstairs. Just like the old timers would say, Joe, you kill the body, the head will follow. Good counter punch. Oh, a nice two punch combo by Banks. Banks is being so very effective, punching in combination. And yeah, that's what you want. He's got pretty good hand speed. Might as well use that hand speed. No better way to use it than putting them together. Big landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. <clears throat> yeah, he pulling them back now. He pulling them now. I can't get to him. Start of round number one round. Young sizzling up those punches thrown stats, but nothing else is working for him. He has not earned a single round on your scorecard. Well, I don't like the kind of punches he's throwing. He should go to the butcher shop. Cut some fat off those punches. And now they're trading blows. Big defense did a good job there, able to avoid that punch. Firing off the uppercut. Great exchange. He missed with that headshot. All right, let me cut him off. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. Young's looking for a way to get this fight back on course. A course that can get him a victory. This isn't it. He's just trying to counterpunch these middle rounds. No, this is not it. He's not thinking right. You know, it's, it's one thing to say physically, technically, he needs to do that. But to do it, you have to be mentally clear. You have to be seeing the plan, seeing what you have to do, what you have to order your body to do. He's not seeing that right now. Boy, sharp two-punch combination by Big. A little something for his opponent after getting tagged. Bruh! Banks has got to be careful.
careful not to fall prey to what so many fighters them, do. Them alternating uppercuts is annoying. But you may not stay that way. He's getting some sound advice from his corner. Quit following him. Cut him off. And now committing to that midsection as the target with the combination punching. Keep moving. Keep moving. Biggs not throwing the power punches, Teddy. What would you say to him? Well, first of all, I would say to him, what do you think that he's going to make a deal with you? If you don't hit him hard, he won't hit you hard? No, no, it doesn't work like that, my friend. He's going to get confidence now. He's going to take advantage of this. That is Boxing 101. A nice, crisp combination by Young. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Takes one, gives one. The right hand scores well. Took a shot. Now he gives a left. Goes up top again. Nice. Committing to the work downstairs with the left. Good flush shot upstairs. Keep that head moving, baby. Come on, Chad. That's okay. That's okay. Let it go. Let it go. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. A nice block by Bang. Shit. This has been a very entertaining fight. <sighs> it's getting annoying, man. I would really be surprised if he he eating a lot of fucking shots. It just has that kind of feel to me. Yeah, it has a feel to me like going to one of those places where you can eat all the pasta you can for one price, you know? And some guys get carried away. They eat about five bowls. Well, these guys, they're going to have a stomach ache at the end. Somebody is going to wind up not standing at the end. Banks is whipping there. A big, wide, sweeping shot. I mean, perfect to counter against. Yes, it is. And you know it's only a matter of time. You know, that goes into the old computer, the old brain, where the guy be right that. And the next time, he's going to capitalize on it. Good combination to the body. A little head hunting with the right. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Focus. Focus. Clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Big. Come on, kid, focus. Combination to the head. Well off the mark by Banks. Doubling up that jab. It serves him well to the body. Nice. Right after catching one by Bro, come on. Bro, this shit is annoying. Scored well with that straight left. <clears throat> Young's back in his corner after Running the like a bitch throwing up the pit. The round that I think he won, and we haven't said that about previous rounds, but that <sighs> was clearly... I don't think he won that one. Yeah, he made some adjustments. You know, his attitude is a little bit better. He's more aggressive. But, you know, you can be more aggressive and you can lose the rounds even bigger because now you're walking into more punches. He's making adjustments. He's starting to move his head a little bit. He's starting to pick up certain opportunities from counters. He's starting to look like a smarter fighter now. Real 
real knack for infighting, and right now he's getting an invitation to do as he pleases in these middle rounds. Yeah, he's not hesitating. Yes, and he's not hesitating. Bro, he's come on. RSVP and fight away and say, okay, I'll take you up on that invite. A stinging uppercut by Big. Bro, how is he blocking so damn fast? Targeting that head with the combination punching. Not able to land the headshot. Bro. That counter punch was very effective. He scored well. Nice work by Banks. Banks is giving his opponent this round. Bro, come on, man. This shit ass as hell, bro. Now the opponent has to make an adjustment. Start streaming, bro. That he's finding air more than he's finding any. Nah, I'll just start, bro. Build it as you go. To the place that's not moving. Down to the Damn. Four rounds. To take away some of that head. I'm up one. The fuck? This is such a tough spot to Bro, he is beating my ass with that. Number eight. He's ahead on your scorecard, Teddy, but he knows. He's got damage to the face. The ref and the ringside position are taking a look. Bruh. Yeah, now it's going to go into different quarters, different dimensions a little bit. You know, we know physically he's been able to do what he's had to do. But now mentally, can he keep himself together as he deals with controversy, where he deals with this kind of situation of not being able to see real good for the first time in his career? Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. Another flush shot up top. Look at his block. <laughs> you see? To improve that accuracy, miss with the headshot. And he's marking that target right above the belt. Bro, how is he throwing through body shots like that? I don't know how they are keeping this up. They are setting such a scorching pace of action. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by me. Zoning in on that gut <clears throat> combination punch downstairs. Yeah, this shit cheese. This shit cheesy, bro. <laughs> bro, come on, bro. Come on, bro. He punched it through that shit. He punched through everything since my knockdown. That shit ass as fuck. He's spamming nothing but uppercuts at this point. Shit working. I don't know why though. Banks is getting a break as for now, but he looked horrible at the end of that round. That shit ass, bro. Now this is where you really have to have to resolve the mentality of a fighter because he's got to go back and face that in a minute when he comes out of his corner. Can he face that? Can he push that away out of his consciousness? Come on, bro. You can't punch. Him. You can't do that. He eat my straight. Throws a counter punch there. Banks is out to show everybody that he's fine. 
but we saw what happened in the last round. He was knocked down in that last round. Does he have to prove something to himself as well as proving something to everybody in this arena? Well, that's the right question. So Another straight. Visit his memory banks a little bit. Another straight. Come on. He's proven it to himself. He's been in this position before, so he has to regain that confidence and understand that he can deal with this. He's done it before. And how is Gar getting back so fucking fast, bro? Reflex is stupid. Another straight. He ain't gassing or nothing, yo. <laughs> Bruh, come on. Bro, come on, bruh. Come on, bruh. Come on, bruh. That's wild. That's wild. That's wild right there, bro. I hit him with like 10 straights in a row. The fuck is we doing? He finally hit me with something. I go down. That's crazy. Your ass must be cheating, cheating, huh? It's cool. It'd be like that. Still, still whooping your ass. So. Way, he's gonna continue on here. And if he's gonna stay in this fight, now he's gonna avoid this opponent like the black plague. And now he's acting like a fighter. Coming back with the right hand after getting scored upon. How's he hitting me with that uppercut, bro? How's he hitting me with that? How's he hitting me with that motherfucker? Don't Nigga, I'm throwing. Nigga ain't going down. This has been a real good one tonight. And now it comes down to this. The final round. Staying away from those headshots with his defense up top. Really good work right there. Landing the two punches in sequence by Banks. But he also gave one. Solid effort by Big. How about that left right there? Banks is gaining momentum on his side. Big, big shot he just scored. Fucking playing with me. Wow, is this good stuff? What good stuff? Bitch ass nigga. After being knocked out earlier. Quit playing with me. I get busy. Quit fucking playing with me, bro. Trash! Got his ass. The fuck? Get your bitch ass up, cuz. Uppercut, man. Let's fucking go. Caught his dumb ass. Hold on, hold on. Let's go back. Whoa, whoa. Oh yeah, he was gonna win that. He was gonna win that. I needed that. Fuck you talking about? Uppercut ass nigga. How many uppercuts he throw? Two hundred and seventy-three. Right uppercut. He was spamming the shit out that uppercut, bro. Fucking bitch. Got him. Got him. Quit playing with me. I have to press that bitch button, bro. I'm fucking them great. <clears throat> All right, come on. All right, let me check. Let me check. Let me check. All right, he got five assists. I got a demon on him right now. 9.5 assists. Ew. He got 10 points in assists. What is points in assists for? 22 and a half? No. 35 and a half? God damn. Probably the first quarter over with. Rory only got two. They ain't passing that man the ball. Mmm. Tough. Fucking tough. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Check on my hockey joints. Dude, bro, you need to get a go, bitch ass thing.
Mm. All right. Out the phone. Out the phone. <clears throat> he had reach advantage. If I lean back and hook, I was missing my hook. He was leaning hard to the right after. So that's why I just start popping that straight out. When he'll pick his head up, I just pop it straight, pop it straight, pop it straight, pop it straight. Couldn't catch him with my hooks. He got a little reach advantage. I think he had like a 75-inch reach. He was using the shit out of that. Nah, not mine. Mine, mine got the little short T-Rex arms. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, I was trying to get his ass with him. Couldn't get him. He was good at uh, getting out the way of them hoes. <clears throat> I had to pop. I had to use the straight. That's the best punch I could have used. That's to keep the distance, so he could throw them uppercuts all he want to in thin air. But I'm gonna rock his ass. He let me get the three power punch combo off. It was over for his dumb ass. He went to sleep. He should have been asleep a couple times. I ain't gonna lie. That boy was spamming the shit out them uppercuts, man. No shame. Throwing eight in a row every time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Jab. 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 Next corner. Throw eight more to get out the corner. <clears throat> what up, my boy? What up, David Wilkins, man? What up, man? Man, that was a tough one, man. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, that was a tough one. Different scenes and different concepts. Yeah, I get it. I mean, yeah. I'm look, my name is literally Lazy Gamer, bro. I just wanna play. I just get on and play. That's look, the extra shit. I'll get to it one day. <laughs> <laughs> one day, I'll get to that shit one day, but it's not gonna be today and it's not gonna be tomorrow. I ain't gonna lie to you. I got limited amount of time. I don't got time to be editing shit. I tried editing, I done edited a few videos. I just don't I don't see the the return unless it's like a big gap in gameplay or something. Nah, I go in and cut it out. But other than that, mm -mm. I just go ahead, upload it, how it is. Or if I make a video, I'll probably snip it and put a couple transitions in it. Put like a little, you know, banner screen or something. Let you know what's going on if ain't no commentary. And then gameplay type shit. <clears throat> but yeah, man, it's just, I wouldn't say it's easy. It's just a lot of toiling you'll do. A lot of trying different new shit out. You got to find, you know, what your people like. It's not even necessarily like what you like. Just like what what catch their attention that you comfortable with doing as far as, like, your titles, your, your screens, shit like that. Find the balance of what you comfortable with and what work, and then rock out from there type shit. Uh, what should I do, y'all? Some little head movement, little wiggle? Nah, that ain't, that ain't nothing for my money, young. Damn, man, this shit's so expensive, bro. I'm not doing nothing to no jab. Combination? What'd that do? Speed? All right, speed plus two. I'll take that. That was a good investment. I could use a little speed. I feel you. I feel you. <clears throat> shit. I'm a little busy too, man. I ain't busy. Once I get off work, I be tired. I ain't gonna lie. I'm getting old. I be tired, but I don't even wanna do shit. <clears throat> Look, Adonis Creed, Ryan about to fight your bitch ass, bro. Fight your bitch ass, bro. You look like a headache to fight. Look, let me check the bet. See y'all. Look, man. Fight night too slow right now. Got a little baseball action going on. 
I know LeBron ain't on the bench. Let me pull a game up. Ooh. Let me pull a game up. Put it on the other TV. Hold on. Man, you can't use our bathtubs. Put that on the TV so I could just look over my shoulder. Yeah. No, wrong TV. No. No. Not that TV, cuz. Why is that up? I'm back. Back. Come on. Remote. Work. Should never took the other remote out this front room. I took the new remote because it's the same brand of TV as the one in my room. I took the good remote and put it in the room because I don't really touch this TV like that. But turn that that sound, little sound down. Oh my God, why I press that? Why I press that? I'm the fucked up. Hold on, y'all. I'm tripping. Shut your ass up, TV. Shut up. Shut your the fuck up, TV. Mm, mm, mm. I put the game back on because I forgot I could turn it down with the fucking phone and shit. I'm tripping. This technology pretty cool, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm like an old person figuring out how shit works. Now LeBron on the bench. LeBron ain't never on the bench right now. And they only up five. That's crazy. Not LeBron on the bench. You need a you need a breather. Get up, bro. Ain't no ain't niggas playing, bro. Get your bitch ass up, Dan Woody. Is that Dan Woody? No, that's some other nigga, man. Get your bitch ass out the game, bro. Now you faking hurt in the playing game. You crazy, bro. You ain't never playing no more. You ain't getting no more minutes, cuz. You get no burn. You play through injuries. Uh, I'll fight this nigga. Not Bam Bam. Didn't I just beat Bam Bam? You don't want this smoke. I'm going to beat the dust off this bitch. Oh, man. Hey, I'm undefeated tonight, though. On what, though? What am I, 3-0? I'm 3-0 right now. I'm going crazy. Whole time. <clears throat> Told y'all I'm the best at this shit. <laughs> if you want to fight, you go fight me. You grabbing a 40 on what, though? Little ass gun. Grab that 4-5 on your ass, nigga. Quit playing with me. Grabbing a 40. <clears throat> man. Come on, man. I'm trying to fight somebody. Somebody come get these hands. Come get these hands. Come get these hands. Come on, man. Dang, I should have put some big money down. I ain't going to lie. I feel like I wasted the opportunity to flip something. It's halftime. He definitely gonna hit ten. He gonna hit ten assists in the third quarter. But then I need Draymond to go crazy and give me seven and a half. <clears throat> this hockey nigga going crazy with the the hockey goalie dude going crazy right now. Hachimura got five, nineteen and a half. He a little under pace. It's almost second half. Well, it's almost halftime. So you got to have a big, big second quarter, third quarter. Herb Jones got seven. I need him for 14 and a half points and rebounds. Probably should have just took him on points. I think his points was like, damn, I think his points was 11 and a half. I should have just took him on points. Because I was going to take his rebounds. Mm-hmm.
lose on purpose. I mean, yeah, they w- will probably get uh, wouldn't they get lottery? No, they wouldn't get lottery. Lose on purpose for what? They need to play. This the play in. No, they need to. No, they fuck around winning this shit. I don't know why they struggling. What's going on? Brian having a bad game or something? He probably ain't passing it to him, though. No, I'm Brian. He trying to go for 37 and shit. He's going to turn it up. And I think they get a couple days off after this, right? To avoid the Nuggets? If they lose... Hold on. How many playing games is it? Two? Let me check the bracket. So, so if they win, who they go play? They go go against Golden State Warriors to get in. If the Warriors win, or do it work the other way? Do they play the Eastern uh, playing teams? I don't know how that worked per se. Playing tournament. Oh, yeah, they'll play. No. Nah. Oh, they're going to have to play Denver regardless. They can't. Okay, now I'm confused as fuck. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm confused as fuck. Okay, so do the winner of the Lakers Pelicans play the winner of the Kings and... Golden State, and then they should lose to Golden State to play OKC instead of Denver. That's what you're saying? I mean, because I am I got it right here. Like, I don't know if you could. Damn, you can't see that shit. You can't see that shit. The way it's set up, it's hard for me to understand. I'm a little slow. <laughs> Let me know. Because then now it makes sense, but. No, go through Denver ass. Ain't no, that's the hardest team for you to beat. Denver, Denver, the toughest. Well, let me see. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the Suns trash. Timberwolves trash. Shit, Denver and the Celtics is your hardest. Yeah, them your hardest ones. I mean, Denver and Celtics is your hardest matchup. Well, your hardest which calls regardless. So, when get the AC, so they'll play OKC. It'll be OKC versus. I mean, however you split it, however you split it. Because if you beat them, you have to beat Boston. <laughs> We're gonna end up Boston fucking Lakers, which will be historic. That do numbers. And then the young boys go win or lose. Who who done did some scoring, bro? Man, okay, she is good, bro. Young fella definitely be balling. Man, test your mic, cuz. You might get me. <clears throat> he ain't want no smoke. You got the Nuggets winning it all? Eh, I don't know, bro. Sometimes sometimes that offense look a little suspect. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, but they all, all everybody offense look kind of shaky sometimes. So, I mean, that wouldn't be a bad choice. I say it's in between them and Boston. They the favorite, so. Well, Denver obviously is not a favorite, but I think that's by design. I'm going to fight this nigga. Eduardo Castro. <clears throat> yeah, they boiling, so. I mean, I'm going to actually watch all the playoffs this year. I normally just watch, you know, pop in, pop out, but. Yeah, definitely gambling. 
<laughs> you gambling on them? Ooh. Well, you either know early or late if you <laughs> first round out of there it might happen. Shit. Go ahead, AD. Snatch them boards, D. Did I take AD for a bit? Damn, I should have took Austin Reeves. Because Brian ain't shooting no threes. Oh, he got fouled at the buzzer. That's crazy. That's crazy work. That was a good heads up play. They ain't gonna challenge that. That's crazy. I right, challenge the shit out of that. <clears throat> Brian needs some more post moves, man. Save your body from banging in the paint, bro. Do an outside pivot, up fake, bro. Spin back. Two dribbles to the middle, fade off, bro. That's an easy bucket. Man, I'll teach Brian some moves, bro. When your leg's gone, you trying to get a little shot off, bro. That's that's my undefeated. <laughs> Spin baseline, keep the pivot. Spin back, two dribbles to the middle. Look, fader from like five feet. Look, easy buckets, man. Ain't no more slapping glass and pearling on niggas no more. My, I'm too heavy for that. Yeah, he definitely do. He's so strong, man. You, Man, when you physically talented like that, I notice people is lazy on skills. Like, as far as, like, finesse moves type shit. Dog. Them bitches come in handy, bro. That's the only way I can still play basketball. Them bitches come in handy, I tell you. So is that a block? I ain't take fantasy. Shit, I should have took fantasy. My mind going crazy right now. I was at work when I put these bits in. Hmm. He needs to move the ball around some more, though. I don't think I'm going to get no more fights, y'all. These niggas turned up on here. I'm going to keep trying, though. <clears throat> I mean, he more he a more skilled Giannis. Because he don't, he don't got one move going to the rack. He got both hands. He a skilled slasher and passer. I mean, you got your gifts. You can't have it all. I just give him the GOAT because if anybody, as far as players that, like, because basketball is a five-man game, bro. Everybody was trying to be Jordan. That's a one-man game, bro. You're not playing one-on-one -on -one against one-on-five. Can't do that in this league. I'd rather play with LeBron than Michael Jordan. I ain't gonna lie to you. <clears throat> That's just me as a player. I, I just, you know. Or if I had to mimic my game after a person, it would probably be Brian. Because I'm a good passer. But I'm a scoring passer. But I don't got the, I don't got the lungs for scoring no more. That take a lot of effort, bro. I be chilling. I just pick a few spots. We need a bucket. I got this one, y'all. <laughs> I'm like, after these two, though, I'm going to have to take a couple plays off on phone now. I mean, it's to each his own. It's, it's how you, how you want to play the game. It's how people like to play the game. So you want to be MJ. I don't need to score to win the basket. I just want to win. I'm going to get back once my hand get right. I got to go make an appointment because I can't even work out. And it's pissing me off. I could, but it's going to piss me off. I really want to lift. And I can't, like, articulate my wrist with a load on it. Like, so if I got to wait, I can't. Yeah, that shit dead. I could, like, deadlift something. But as far as me 
like turning my wrist over and like this with a dumbbell hell no nah. no type of weight five pound i can't even do i can barely live my uh lift my uh tool bag at work be pissing me off because i do it and i hurt myself piss me off man i'm trying to get back in shape so i can hoop go to this appointment hopefully i don't got no nerve damage or nothing i'm out to sue niggas for a couple meal y'all like gonna see me on youtube or you might i'm just had that money on i'm had that money on by mclaren's and stupid shit like it can be you just get into an accident and hurt yourself and then <laughs> i'll fuck with y'all i do money giveaways i need a million subs though quit playing with me i'm giving away five g's no i'm playing not really giving away five G's, y'all. Damn, I'm not too secure about these bets right now. Brian done cooled off. It's halftime now, I think. Yeah, it's halftime. So never mind, I'll take that back. Bro, let's get it, bro. I got you by three points. You got me by three points. Why you gone? These niggas do not want no phase, bro. Let's go back up to lightweight. I mean, yeah, middleweight. I'm sorry, y'all. This the server is cheap. It's 90s and above day, I guess. I ain't get the memo. Darren did not get the memo, bro. Unholy purge, you a bitch. Let's run this, gangster. Black men love fat white women. He gotta be white. I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, what you care about what niggas like, bro? Hmm. Hmm. It was just tax season, G. <clears throat> Ooh, for 1K, y'all. Ooh. That's not gonna end good. Y'all gonna end up throwing hands. Hope y'all got a riff, because you know it's gonna be hack season. See, I want it. See, this, look, look, look. This is what I, I want to tell y'all my real plan with YouTube, bro. I want to come in doing the 1v1s. But my friends like to drink and go to the club every weekend. Because every time we get together, we either end up arguing about hooping or just some stupid shit. Or who the best basketball player some stupid shit like that. I'm like, I for real bust all y'all ass. Drunk as hell, though. We went to the park and everything. I couldn't do shit. Like, it hit me when we was driving to the park. I'm like, I'm a little fucked up. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't say shit. Went there, tried to shoot. Was like, yeah, I'm drunk, y'all. Next time. But I'd love to get, like, a 1v1 series going on, my nigga. Because we all hoop. Well, all hoop. Some of us still active, though. But some of us not. But niggas can hoop, though. That's what I really wanted to do. But that's hard to set up, bro. I finally got a camera. So, go to the park if you want to get some 1v1s in. I'm definitely going to post them. I'm going to hit my guys see what they're trying to do. And trying to get them to play the game and stream and shit. Them niggas just be playing the game all day. Like, bro, get a webcam, bro. Try something. I fuck with you. But uh, yeah, I ain't fucking with it. They cool. They too cool for this. Bro, come on, bro. Can we can we fight, bro? You seen my record already or what? I'm ready to fight, bro. I can line you up though for real, for real. I got the clippers on. Hook your back up, bro. Your back. Look. A little wild back there. You need like a little taper, a little fade or something. I'll leave you my card after the fight. Get to know you here in the opening round, schedule for 10. 
Garcia's pre-fight talk included a lot of discussions about the need to utilize the jab. Why so? Well, first of all, he's a good fundamental fighter, and he's not a real physical fighter. So he understands where he has to be good. He knows he doesn't have, you know, great, great physical skills where he can just knock a house over. He knows he has to be good in this area, using that lead hand to jab. Not precise at all by Bang. Garcia is the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. Oh, I, I remember, dude. He the one-two man. That's how I beat him. He go one-two to the body, and I just <laughs> hit him with a straight every time. <laughs> Damn! Bitch! <laughs> But it can work the other way. You know, a jab is such a great weapon, but if it's not thrown at the right distance, at the right speed, at the right time, it could be a way for the outside fighter to get in quick, time a right hand over a jab, maybe a slow jab. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. So many times you hear of an early round where they're just feeling each other out. No way. Not these guys. Straight to action. Well, if they can keep this up, they're both going to have headaches, but we're going to have a special one on our hands. A solid one-two combo left-right by Prince. Prince is just punching air that time. His opponent was able to get out of the way. Good right hand by Prince. Garcia's combination punching here is showing you what good boxing is all about. Three punches thrown, three punches landed. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Right to the head with that right. Oh, he is stunned. He could go down. Damn, man. We out there banging. Why ain't getting no knockdown? No no at a more opportune time. <clears throat> he was hit rocked in that round. But now in the corner, they have to bring him back. They have to revitalize him because, believe me, there might not be bells going off in his head right now. But this oh, shit. Noise. Yeah, y'all gonna be going through it. Don't get the tussling, man. Y'all need a riff. Y'all need rules. Y'all need to get all the rules down. If y'all calling y'all own files, you only get two in a row. Well, nah, you can exploit that. Y'all just need rules type shit. I really do, because he's going to have to do a Houdini to get out of this. Scores with the uppercut. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Prince. Great work offensively landing that combination by Prince. Takes a step back. Then the counter punch by Garcia. Very similar to what you see Floyd Mayweather do. You know, make a miss, pull that shoulder back, and then come right back with the counter. Damn, that was a nice one, too. Ooh, watch out for that. Uppercut combination. He tied. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. Waiting for his opponent, just waiting for an opportunity. Why am I still hurt? The counter punch by Banks comes right back at him with a left hand. Look at that combination by Garcia. Hard to believe they can still give like this in these final moments of what has been a sensational round. I feel like I'm back at the amusement park on a roller coaster again, like a kid. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Garcia is thumped by a left hand. Back and forth they go, each man getting the best of it. Prince is just being swarmed. He just got stunned. He got absolutely nailed. Very nice work from both men. They each got a shot in. Bro, come on. Banks is rocked by a big shot. Bro, how the fuck is he still throwing like that? He threw through my stun. It'd be like that. Facts. <laughs> Facts. Y'all need to bring the gloves. Oh, you showed Hey, you showed it to me three times. Your bitch ass better not lose, pussy. They just cheated me out of knockdown to get this bitch ass. It'd be like that. Should have took the nine count. And he 
he catches a lucky break. Saved <clears throat> by the bell here. They're about to quit. Of the round, Teddy. Yeah, right away you're thinking, you know, where do I spend my time right now? You want to tell them things that can help them. You bulking up. Really you should not be bulking right up now. the hoop, bro. You got to get them clear, <laughs> my Do <laughs> not bulk up. My boy trying to bulk up, be Shaq in the paint. I need to lose about 75. I'll be good at like 250-ish. Banks' hope is for him to be steady on his feet and just survive at this point. Remember, that last round, he was down and nearly out. Well, his hope is that his corner revived him during that minute rest. And also, they gave him good advice because the most important thing is don't let what happened the last round happen again. Correct what you did wrong. There he goes. I ain't try to hear, but that was funny, though. Defense is paying off now. Goes up top with a right hand. His opponent wanted the body. He wouldn't give it to him. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Good job. Good job. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Keep it going. Bro, come on. A solid uppercut by Prince. Banks is really bringing a lot with that uppercut, Teddy. How is he doing that with no stems? And bringing the power behind that punch. Well, that's a good question. That's everything. You ever watch Tiger Woods when he's hitting a golf ball? You know, he just drives his lower body through that ball. Well, it's the same thing. Your lower body, you hit, you rotate them, and you just drive that lower body up into your punch. How is he throwing power shots with no stem? Return to sender. He gives him back one of his own. That's crazy. How is he throwing power combos with no stem, bro? I done drained the shit out this man. No counter? That's crazy. That's crazy. That doing me dirty right now. Round number four is underway. Yeah, give me my round. He's got to feel pretty good about where things stand right now because he's still very much in this fight. It's anybody's fight. I see he's still glitching that back movement like that, and it's still that fast. Fight of attrition. Whoever's in better shape because this is every round being contested. Rain! Rain! Well timed by Garcia. He took a step back, landed the counterpunch. Exactly what he wanted to do. Takes one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here? Today? Well, two aspirin and then. Go, oh, no. Actually, I would say a little counterpunching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription. Man, so dangerous. Bro, come on, bro. A two punch combination landing. Now how he do that, bro? And a well placed counter by Garcia. Good work. Through the straight right hand, but didn't score with it. Cause you're like the stupidest type of bitch I like to play. Let's play your game. It's fun. Watch this. Oh, I missed it. Damn. Next time. I'm gonna do it three times. Watch. So now the question becomes, after that knockdown, and he has got enough, how does he survive? Yo, this is where instincts kick in. You got to start moving that head automatically right now. You don't want to stay in the middle. Stupid ass. Again, he goes down. Can he survive this? Get you in your shit. Little ugly ass bitch, look. 
Uh, who you, who you throwing at? Uh, broke your nose, man. <sighs> Damn. That's just like a, look, it's just beautiful. Cause you're stupid, look. Dumbass. Dumbass. Shut your bitch ass up, bro. Come get some more. Come get this work. You're about to get this work. Garcia's climb back up from the canvas may inspire him. How about a return to center with the left? Ooh! Hand? Chris is right in this fight. Throw the wrong punch. Trailing on the car. Bitch ain't in this fight. Bitch, quit playing. Bitch, quit. Bitch, quit playing with me, you puss ass nigga. This fight could soon be over. I'll make you quit. This love look hit you right in your shit, look. Let's watch it three times. I'ma show you six replays. You show me three, I'ma show you six. Crazy work. I'ma show you nine replays. You about to get up, I'ma put your dumb ass right back down. I'ma show you three more. Told you you better not fuck around lose, didn't I? Guess what your dumb ass did. <laughs> Guess what your dumb ass did. You go fuck around and lose. Get your bitch ass up, bro. Get up! Puss ass nigga. That's what I be talking about. Don't show no replays next time, bitch. Fucking go. You gonna show me some fucking replays. I told him, don't fuck around and lose. You wanna show me the replays? Turn that power on your dumb ass. It be like that. And it begins the next night. The next I was about to torture his ass at that point. You gonna show me the replays, bro? Quit playing me. <sighs> Fuck wrong with dude. Fuck you mean? Hey. Yeah. Hey, huh? That that was the left G. But it was nasty though, wasn't it? Caught his dumb ass. He showed me the replay. See, I got in his head. I said, you better not fuck around and lose. Yep, yep. Then I just stop punching. I just start, uh. That's what I do. I come out hot and swing with you. But if you do something to me, I'm going to just switch my whole style up on you. You ain't going to be able to keep up with it. And then I go back to punching like a motherfucker. Then I stop. You'll think I'm tired, so you go do some dumb shit. I'm going to catch your dumb ass with what a haymaker cuz go to sleep put some ice on you'll be better in the morning mm. facts i'ma tell you i'ma fuck you up you better not lose bitch that's what i'll tell you you better not lose because i'm gonna talk to you so greasy he did it to himself. He probably reporting me all type of shit. Fuck him though. He showed me the replays. Off some fluke shit though. That's the whole thing. He got a knockdown off a power combo. I landed. I'm like, ain't that about a bitch? Quit playing with me. Uh, he a 91. I'm scared of him. No mas. Even though I did beat a 90 today. Eh. Let's see if we done made some more movement on these bitch, y'all. Let me check the funions on the munion. Refresh the page. You gotta always refresh the page. Alright, we got six assists. We need four more. We got two quarters for that. We got time. Uh, yeah, 21 and a half, 31. I think we got time for that, too. We good. Hachimura needs to score, bro. Herb Jones got 10. Pass the ball, AD, bro. Damn. Bitch ass nigga. Damn. Who hurt? Who hurt? Who hurt? Brian? Get up, Brian. Get your bitch ass up. Get your bitch ass up, bro. Get up. Uh, let's see. 88 overall. Yeah. Shit. 
Shake that shit off, Brian. That's a plan, bitch. I beat out, I beat the shit out this nigga. On what though? He ain't trying to fight. He ain't trying to fight. He just trying to sit there and be stupid. <clears throat> Come on, man. Get a ball to worry out tomorrow, bro. Five swing on yo. What happened? What happened? You got fouled. You on the line. Good job, Rory. Hori, Hori Hachimura or is Rory Hachimura? I don't know how to say his name, but. Do I fight in heavyweight? Hell no. Nah. <laughs> I don't fuck with heavyweight. The only time I fuck with heavyweight is on head to head. I ain't gonna lie to you. All them niggas do is spam straights, bro. And sidestep uppercuts. I'm not prepared for that type of white knuckle play style, bro. I literally broke the shit out of my controller after that. Y'all want me to play up there? I'll fight this nigga. Fuck it. I know, hey, he a mod. I'm about to play a mod for y'all. That's how That's how much I'm trying to entertain y'all. Because I appreciate y'all pulling up. Bro, I got a steal. Too bad I got... There we go. Shmink. Oh, he break, he break the shit out that three. Damn, d -Lo. Fucked up in the sis. I would rather my boy get fouled or something. He putting the mod song right now. I told you he's a mod, y'all. Told y'all this man the mod, bro. Boardwalk Hall at the famed Atlantic City Boardwalk in Southern New Jersey for tonight's main event. Ten rounds of lightweight action. Boy, and we expect this to be a big night of action. We spoke with both fighters yesterday. Fireworks anticipated right. tonight. Let's see. This is about to be hella five gameplay right here. You the feeling here that he's completely indifferent to all the Oh, yeah, they super I mean, racist. The what was his uh game thing? I didn't even see it. It's either he a spammer or a modder. I forgot which one he was. Yeah. All the talk, all the hype. Now the fight. Round one scheduled for ten. Teddy, what should we look for early? We've heard so much about his jab. Is it as simple as that? Yeah, it is. For him, it is. I mean, not just yeah. He'll buy. See how fast he is. And also a range fighter. You know, it gets the distance that he needs to complete everything else. See how fast that shit is. Look. Same hand. I'm going to let him throw it. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. Banks is known as a guy who isn't going to be bashful early Look at that. On. What was he that? What? What's that animation, y'all? Yeah, like that's a half throw. That's all that this business is about. My mentor, Cosimato, used to say, hey, you know, power is just part of it. It's kind of like having a military weapon. You know, you still need a missile to get it there. Alone, all it does is make a hole in the ground. Otherwise, it has no real use. You have to have a way to get it to the target. Let's see if he has that way. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. Scored well upstairs with the right hand. He's got his guard up really well that time, and it protects his head. <laughs> Final 10 seconds of round number one. That is a big right hand after eating. I'm cool with that. 
<clears throat> yeah, he gonna keep throwing that straight out there like that. Yeah, he go, he stay, he go same hand, side step, uppercut, straight. I'm let him throw it. Let's see how long he keep it up. Normally, I be trying to fight him and get him out the way and counter him and shit. It's speed up too. That's why he can side step so fast. Because now you're gonna hit him a little in the body because the body's not moving. They trade shots. He comes back with a right hand. How's that bitch landing? It's like extendo. I'm out to switch stances. That belt line well. Halfway through round number two. Teddy, early on here, you cannot stress enough how much good comes from going to the body. And you can't stress how many times you heard your parents tell you as a kid, put that change into the piggy bank because it's going to add up. Well, body punches add up. Hits him in the mug with the right. Protecting his head well with his guard. <laughs> Good job staying away from the danger there. Final ten seconds of round number two. Locks it away. Do that again. <laughs> and we come to the end of round number two. Banks' corner better explain to him clearly why he lost that last. I don't know. I block. I was blocking more when I was left handed. Find change on the beach. You go out there with a metal detector. Well, right now we need a. I gotta find his range. I'm just stay on the outside of. He needs a jab to find the mark. Good work defensively by Banks. Plus. He landed that counter punch. Yeah, and he forced him to punch. He made him, he threw it out of him, and then he timed him beautifully. Gets rid of that body shot. I'm gonna get his ass. Oh. Double. That right Double. hand over the top lands flush. And right from the start, he's throwing the power punches and landing them. I think he has a date he wants to get to it. Bazooka's opponent knows exactly what the game plan can be now. <laughs> landed with some success. <laughs> the step, look, jab, step back. <laughs> it landed every time. After he got hit. Yeah, he don't like that. Banks missing the mark by a mile. That just was nowhere to be found. Bazooka's going to think about the next time he throws a punch because he just got hit by a good solid counter. Banks has got to deal with a cut cheek. Good exchange. He fires back. <laughs> Oh, he got me that time. Third round. Got him that time. And that's the end of round three. Deep breath, deep breath. Holy shit, you are in control of this fight, man. My jab ain't really gonna do shit. I ain't gonna lie to you. It ain't mocked up or nothing. I just used it though. I hit him with the jab, but I did the back step straight when he did it. Just to be on the outside. I felt like I won that last round, but. That was me. 
disappointed after getting tagged oh, like that. Oh, shit. Nothing. Well, his opponent is opening up and coming forward, so I would think there are some opportunities that exist. Yeah, I think some counter-punching opportunities. Opportunities. That'll be hard to one-punch me. My, my block match stop. There's a straight right hand. Got to back up. Fuck. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. He missed by a How the fuck I missed? I pulled the first one. By Banks. Banks is showing you that sublime skill right now with that two punch combo. Halfway through round number four. right back and you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head banks is putting his punches together now that's a nice combination Turn the miles down, bro. Not getting it done with that straight right hand. Bazooka's now showing off what he probably worked very hard on in the gym. You can see that the effective footwork, the movement, is making for this to Come be on. a really easy round for him. Teddy, what kind of he ain't smack him, bro. It was more of a push muff mixture. It looked weird as hell. Like he wanted to smack him, but he was already in motion of pushing him. I'll make him just make the guy miss. Just use his legs, use his head movement, use his blocking skills, and make sure he concentrates exactly on one thing, defense. He's shown it right now. Blocks a shot and then does nicely to work on his own. Oh, what a whiff by Banks. Well, something's got to stick. He sends the combination to the body. You're doing great. He scored well after being hit himself. Look how fast he moved. What a thudding shot he just landed. Well, he left the left hand out there a little lazy, and he crashed it over. How he blocked that, and his hand wasn't back yet. Halfway into round number five here. Make a cheat. Bazooka's right hand. Look how he's throwing that motherfucker. You gotta love the offense there, putting his punches together. That's just good, solid, accurate work by Banks. Banks is finding out right now that this counter punching style is not getting the results he needs in these middle rounds. What is the answer? Well, when a guy's not coming in and walking in, you can't counter punch. I mean, he's not. He's not giving you the kind of turf that you need. Now you have to find a way to create your offense, to lead a little bit. That starts with the jab, getting off first. Yeah, he getting tired. That block getting force. Ten seconds to go in this round. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his Bitch. Own. And that's the end of round five. Yeah, he's starting to crumble a little bit. It is shut, and now the ref is taking a look. And he should be He's still moving fast as hell. He's going to bring the doctor up pretty soon to look at it himself. Well played counter punch by Bazooka. Bro, how the fuck? Well, we were talking about Get out of there, dude! That was close. He went in there and he tore apart that kitchen. How is he still moving so fucking fast? Cheating? More cheats? Bro, come on. Good way to protect the midsection. Bazooka's defense is 
playing a prominent role in this fight, Teddy. Yes, it is, and specifically what it is is he has good fundamentals. He keeps those hands up real good, you know. They're attached, they're up around his chin, his elbows in. You know, he has a real shell there that's not easy to penetrate. Reaching the halfway point of round number six. Banks is putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Banks has got something to think about now. He just threw a punch and had one coming right back at him. His opponent scored well with the counter. Bro, come on. Solid right hand lands. And he returns on that exchange. Banks is being damaged right now. Come on, bro. Is you serious? He is not meant for life on Come on, bro. That's ass as fuck. <laughs> It'd be like that. If you're not going to work out in front, get to a distance where you're safe. He stood there. You turned your mask back up, huh? <laughs> Let's fucking go. Teddy, I question though if he'll be able to go on. What does he have to do? Well, he's got to know what to do, but what not to do. Don't use your legs. Don't try to move because that's the inclination. Get on your bicycle when you've been <clears> hurt. <throat> no, the bicycle. Come on, ah! Flat tires. What you gotta that do? That shit hurt. On the inside, clear your we head. fight to the death around here. Fuck, dude. Unable to land clean by Banks. Banks is coming out here after being knocked down in the previous round. How important is it for him to be cautious here, to make sure that he does have his legs underneath him? You know, it's a little bit of a double-edged sword there, Joe, because if you're too cautious, hey, your opponent, he leaves it. You're not in that ring alone, you know, and then he's gonna get more aggressive. So you wanna go out there, maybe feign him a little bit, let him think you're okay, let him think you wanna go after him, let him think you wanna engage a little bit, and then wind up boxing, staying on the outside, buying some time. Well targeted two punch combo by Banks. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. Focus. You're not focusing. That's a tried and true method that works out very well. The counter punch landing by Bazooka. Not able to connect with the uppercut. Banks' opponent landing an effective counter punch right there. Could this be the start of a big comeback? He went from owning this fight to now nearly down and out. You know, that's what makes boxing so great. Yeah, you can come back just like that. One punch at the right time. That was at the right time. Bazooka's movement helped out there. He avoided that punch. Banks' work rate is impressive, Teddy, but his connect percentage is not. Now, there's two reasons for it, Joe. One is his opponent. His opponent is pretty smart, man. You know, he's not just standing there saying, hey, hit me. He's moving, he's doing smart. Damn, I want to get some money. Keep them up, all right? I mean, you know, he caught you with your hands down. It will be interesting to see. Yeah, I'm trying to make sure he don't opens up and lets his hands go here because so far tonight, as we start round number eight, it's clear on Teddy's scorecard he's just not in the fight. But it's also clear he should have some energy left to deliver. Bro, his fucking his reflex is stupid, bro. Look how the fuck he do that. I just pulled that shot. How are you going to act at that time when it's most important? We're going to find out right now. Bro, quit modding, bro. Quit fucking with it. Just play. Lame ass nigga. So trash. He takes a shot and then commits to giving one right back. Still no defense out of so him. So trash. Still no ability to stop this onslaught. He's taking serious damage. And you got to worry about his future because the oh, damage he's taking now. right now for tonight. Okay. So now I can't hit you. Now, but how is this going to impact him for the future? That I can't land on him. To get into a danger zone right now. Putting his punches together. Good combination by Banks. 
bazooka. His opponent's probably looking at him right now saying, wow, you're not changing anything up. You know, he got to him moments ago. Now, he's got the same style that he's looking at. Bro, how is he yeah, still he throwing that shit? This late. Got to him. Look time. how he's throwing it. I think right now it's too early to all of a sudden throw everything out the window. But look for an adjustment as things don't change. If he can't get away from those punches, if he keeps having problems, he gets stunned again, then you might have to look for it. And yet another big shot comes in. How about that? He goes from being the victim to handing out the punishment. Show it to him three times. Even though I, I might not win this fight, you a bitch. One more time. One, two. He went down from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's doing. I just fucking off. reflexes up the house. Ten seconds of the eighth round. <laughs> Right How is reflexes up so high still? Damn. Being calm and cool when the pressure's on. With that eye completely shut, the pressure is on. Yeah, this is where you're really ultimately being tested as a fighter, as a human being, as a man. we talk about the fact that hey at least he's throwing punches but that's all you can say in this case because he's not landing many oh, no they're being blocked or they're missing they're definitely not landing clean and you have to give credit to the other fighter being that good defensively he's still not moving enough move move bro come on bro His eyes set on the uppercut, but was unable to land it. Oh, shit. A straight right hand. Ooh. Big shot, the left crashed home. Bazooka's combination punching is working well here. Bro, he blocking all those perfect. That's crazy. Hit by a counter punch there. More than one punch downstairs. That could be damaging. Bro, come on. Get him. So are we. What a stunning turn of events. What's good for the goose is good for the gator. Come on, bro. They they cheated me out the knockdown. You spamming like a hoe. And you suck at it. Goddamn weak ass game. Your highlights are so ass. Look at them. Look how you look. Like a bitch. Bring your bitch cheating ass home. I got you cheating and spamming at the same time. That's crazy. Low old, low old guy. Come on, bring your bitch ass on, pussy. And that's the end of round nine. You could tell he cheating because he could still throw that punch and he's still quick with his blocking. He should be gassed. He shouldn't have no stand. I done landed over 100 power straight to the body. He should be dead. I hit him with three in a row, ain't nothing happen. It's like they got they regular health, and then they got a whole subsection of health. You got to go through to get a knockdown. Bazooka's keeping his guard up very, very well. Teddy, does it help to have the speed that he has? Uh, sure. Anytime you have speed, and you can put it into the equation where whatever you do. Bro, come on. Come on, man. And I can't move. 
Look, I tried to back up. I ain't letting the nigga move back for shit. Like, his shit make you so you can't move. <clears throat> I should have threw a power straight to the body. Maybe I would have got a little separation. Anything that land on my face at this point, I'm going down. Because I landed first in that exchange. He punched through too. So I can only full counter. See? He gassing right now. It's two. Well played, straight right hand. Bro, I can't even block those. Banks is landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very that? Why am I acting like I'm tired than him? How is he blocking? How is he blocking? How is he blocking still? What the fuck is that? Bro, he has no stem left. How are you blocking still? How is he blocking? Look. Look how fast that was. Look how fast that shit was, bro. He go from block. He blocks his shot before his hands even come back. Then he throwing the punch. That shit crazy. And he's gas. Get up. We gonna keep playing this bitch. Teddy, this is the stuff of legend right now. He is hurt badly, but still he fights on. You know, this is what Customato, my mentor, used to talk about. He used to say, Teddy, when you got two tough guys, but one's a little smarter, or then he becomes twice as tough. Good right hand. He's punching away, even though he's been stunned. He just missed that shot up top. Look at that shit, bro. He's gas, bro. Bro, you cheating too hard, bro. You definitely pussy. You definitely pussy. Thank you for cheating on stream. Bro, he been cheating the whole fight, bro. <laughs> bro, 308 power shots, bro. Come on, bro. He been cheating the whole fight, bro. Cheating the whole entire fight, bro. This shit ass. It be like that, though. It be like that. Two body shots, bro. I flamed his body the fuck up. Can't hit him in the head. Because he going to spam that straight. Cheating that. It be like that. Damn, I want to report him. Bro, he should have got dropped. A couple times. He should have got dropped the second time I hit him with that body shot. But he got to block every single punch in my combo, which is, come on, that's crazy. That's crazy. And the fact that I got to keep hitting you to knock you down is crazy, too, because my body straight, it, it's automatic knockdown. I shouldn't have to do a whole eight-punch combo after. They be doing me dirty. He put that cheat in after the first time I knocked him down. He turned that shit up. I only got one rock after that. Couldn't get the knockdown. It was OV. This nigga gassing out. Still spamming straights. Those be the worst. Those be the motherfucking worst. Let's go with uppercut to the head. Well, he couldn't get the one punch KO because my chin maxed out. <clears throat> if that was me earlier, like a day ago, yeah, he would have got me out of there. He would have got me out of there real quick. I need Brian to get two more assists. We in the game. No, three more. He need three more.
Another quarter. He got 26. I got him for 20, well, 35 and a half. I should have took him on points. Rory Hachimura at 19 and a half. I need Herb Jones to do something. He need five more. Or else we dead in the water, y'all. I don't want to be dead in the water, no. Let's see. Let's check on the hockey, hockey Jones. Damn. One of my joints already fucked up. That's cool. Got two more tickets. Three. Three more tickets, matter of fact. We looking good. Damn, no, I need this nigga to uh, get an assist or something. It's not looking good for that. Oh, damn. Done turned the game off. <clears throat> All right, one more fight. Well, that was one. I should have. I should have got that. I told you I was about to fight a mod, man. I knew it. I knew it. I be knowing, yo. I'm sorry I couldn't come through for y'all. He probably a mod, too. It feel like it. Yeah, he a mod, too. Because ain't no way nobody... Ain't no 80 overall go fight me, bro. Not no 81 overall. I'd be surprised if it's not a mod, yo. Oh, I'm a little toasty. Fan on. See, I wish I had one of them. Anticipation for this bout has grown as the week has gone on. A lot of talk behind these two. Opening round scheduled for 10. Whether or not he's successful in this fight tonight, that he could come down to what he's been doing in the gym. Word out of all those training sessions is he has developed a great uppercut. And even better than that, Joe, he throws a great uppercut. But what he does also is once he catches you with that, he understands he's going to pick the guy's head up. He puts something right on top with it. Accuracy an issue there. Didn't land that straight right hand. ability to punch to flat out put forth power puts people in the seats early on that's what they expect to see here and early on sometimes too much of a good thing guess what it can be dangerous it can backfire if he lands a punch and it doesn't get rid of the guy well what else can he do what happens then good job on the two punch combo by banks he is taking a lot of damage stunned and staggered Boy, he is shaky right there. He is on shaky ground in the ring right now. Good block there by King. That's the sign of these niggas being mods. Smoke is doing exactly what you should to be a strong defensive fighter. You gotta block those punches away. Oh, and he's got something for him himself, and it's a left hand. Phenomenal pace being set here. They are burning it up early on. Let's find out who's in better shape. We're going to see. He missed with that headshot. What an excellent two-punch combo by Bain. Accurate uppercut after taking a shot of his own. End of the round here on the <sighs> Bro, come here to this venue. Take great fans. I mean, wherever we go, come on, bro. Night tour, we have great fans. Yeah, passionate fans, fans that know the fighters and care about the sport. That's a forceful two-punch combo by King. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by Smokin. Just like that, just like that. Well, you could see what he wanted to do there, but unable to land that body shot. Oh, good exchange there. Now that backhand, the straight left hand, scores well for him. They both land flush with uppercut. Bro, he should not be able to punch through that. And there's the left hand <laughs> working well for him again. He covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Ah, cover 
Thought he had his target, but way off to the side with the uppercut. Banks is scoring very well. Bro, what is the counters, bro? <laughs> Damn. Well, if he sees that hand drop a little bit, instead of the shoulder dipping, if you drop that hand to throw the uppercut, there could be an opening. And he should look for that with the hook. Counter right back. That hand drops, bang. Beat him to the mark with the hook. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Smokin'. Banks is almost looking foolish that time. Bro, this thing is like made out of fucking dynamite, bro. Not dynamite, Good but granny, bro. This shit's stupid, bro. Fucking just punching and hitting dude ass. I got a box, because I'm going to run out of stand. A little head hunting right back to it. Bro, this fucking block is too good, bro. He missed that uppercut. Keep it tight inside. Keep it tight. Good, good. Banks is doing well here with that two punch combination. be elusive. Banks able to land the hook on the inside. Is there anything he should be careful of, though, Teddy, on the inside like that? Ripping off the power punch. Yeah, what up, Mr. What the I fuck is that? Throw my fucking... Sh throw my shot. God damn. Throw my shot, bro. Quit playing with me. Quit fucking playing with me, bro. Throw my damn punch, bro. That's three times. Pussy. I know your bitch ass didn't just quit. Pussy. Bitch ass nigga quit. <sighs> bro, I was trying to throw that shot three times, bro. The input would not go through. Oh my fucking shot, bro. I see that shit. Hit that bitch ass nigga, man. Niggas be hoes. <sighs> Niggas be hoes, bro. I can't be great. The mod got me, though. I'm mad about that shit. I ain't gonna lie. Lost to that bitch ass mod. Pussy ass nigga. I hate that nigga, bro. I hope he get stumped out somewhere for real, for real. <sighs> LeBron, LeBron, LeBron. What do you got? 19? Fucking 9 assists? What that What that equal out to? It's not 35. I know that much. Nigga better get some more points. The fuck? LeBron getting locked up out here. Oh, he got... Oh, yeah. One more assist. It's OV. One more assist. I need that. Come on, Brown, Brown. I need you, Brian Brian. Pause. Dang, it's fourth quarter, too. It's make or break right now. Oh, it's make or break. Oh, oh, no. That's the first drop of the game, sir. G7 SE. That's the first drop. Let's see if it still works. See if it still I'm still here. I'm still here. Everything feel, it feels okay. All right, let's get one more fight in. Whew. Damn, it's 837 already. Damn. It's almost 9 o'clock. I've been grinding, y'all. Almost for three hours, man. You think I, I froze? I'm froze? I don't think I'm froze. Everything moving good still. Hold on, let me check. Check out this YouTube shit. See what's what's going on. <clears throat> Damn, something went wrong. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nine 
No. Still, hold on, let me check. I'm good, bro. I'm check good. Shit, we good. Oh, I got 10 likes. Damn, the likes. Man, I appreciate y'all with them likes, bro. I'm now. No, nah, we good. We good. I'm still on deck, y'all. I'm still here. All right, one more fight, y'all. Then I'm hop off. Because I ain't eat or nothing. I'm a little thirsty. I'm a little thirsty. I'm fucking them gray. All right, come on, man. Play that shit good. All right, I keep fucking with the game. I got to pull it back up now. <clears throat> brun, 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 brun. Oh, Rory got it. Damn, how's some more? 13, one and one. Damn, this nigga ain't getting no boards. Get your bitch ass down there and get some boards, bitch ass nigga. My bad, Hachimura. My bad. I just got money on this, bro. I need you to do other stuff, bro. You need to be well-rounded, cuz. Cuz you definitely ain't got 19 points. Bro, I got a board. Do that count as a board? Yep. I should have been on that Prince nigga, too. He be good. He ain't want no. He ain't want no smoke. Damn. And I should. I should have bet on AD turnovers too. Oh yeah, I'm yeah. I ain't froze, bro. I'm still here. All right. <clears throat> Let me mop the floor with this guy. <clears throat> Real boxing skills. This time I ain't brawling with nobody. All boxing skills right now. I'm about to lock in. Oh, when I sent the message, I froze. Oh, my bad. There's more room for defensive error with the taller fighter, I assume, here. Yes, there is, because now all of a sudden you're punching down. You're taught to punch on a straight plane where you don't leave anything open. You punch down, and somebody comes up with a punch. Next thing you know, you're picking yourself up off the canvas. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. that time it was intended to the head bad intentions is putting a smile on his corner man's face right there and frustrating his opponent with that jab each man able to land an uppercut Bro, that's how you want to play one. I'm going to beat you. You see, he sits and waits and then strikes with that counter punch by bad intentions. Banks showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. Not able to land the headshot. Very accurate two-punch combo by Banks. Bad intentions is defense. Is it ever good? Look at how easy Damn, I'm missing those punches. Last 10 seconds. Bad intentions has got to cut around his eye. That can be a real danger. All right, I think I pulled that round up. Round Woo! comes to an end. And that's one of those rounds, Teddy, that just takes on a certain style, a certain characteristic. And that was a busy one. Stupid yeah, bitch. It was a busy one. Look, Joe, you don't have to look for these guys. They're right there in front of you. Why do you think that is? Why do you think sometimes you just get those rounds where it all happens? Because of styles. You know, styles make fights. In this case, you're seeing proof of that right there. Both guys that are aggressive, both guys that are very confident. Unable to connect by bad intentions. 
bad intention is the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. Nice defense, good block by bad intentions. Wow, look at that, trading shots. A crushing two-punch combo by bad Woo! intentions. Needs to improve that accuracy, missed with the headshot. Yeah, like running through the rain without getting wet. Beautiful. There's the combo downstairs. Now you're seeing stamina right here. How can they possibly keep up this pace? Minutes ago in this round, and they have been all out. I know how I feel, Joe, myself. I mean, I feel like I've been on a roller coaster, except I'm not sitting, I'm standing. <laughs> Too bad that was a jab. That would have been a nice little punch. Targeting the left hand to the body. Final 10 seconds. Blocks the oh. shot and pulls the trigger. We good. And we come to the end. Damn, I'm cut too. Well, shit, we we going out. Cut man is gonna earn his pay for sure. <laughs> that is a bad gash. And I want to get a little cut. Using. In there, you know, you can only use certain things. I'm hitting them with some friendly, shit though. And from, but I'm wondering if he's using I'm waiting on that power straight at the beginning of the round to drop his gun. Man. Kind of I ain't gonna throw it this round. I'm gonna throw power to the body this time. Look. <laughs> now he about to. Well off the mark by bad intentions. A good block. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. A good, clean old one two by Banks. Good scoring shot. It was a straight right. Now his opponent got away from that uppercut. Devastating blow by bad intentions. Man, he just want to go back off everything, so I'm going to just. his opponent after blocking a shot both men digging in with uppercuts not hitting his mark there going upstairs oh what an exchange able to get away from that headshot with the block banks putting forth a great combination there Solid straight right hand. There's the headshot, but he carries it away. He is not in good shape. He could be on the deck in moments. Big shot. It Stupid was bitch. And he pulled the trigger with that straight shot, scoring the knockdown. And he had a beautiful sight there. Three. Stupid bitch. He gets up after that punch, put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy. <laughs> Got to be accurate to send the combination to the body, and he does that. <clears throat> I'll take that. Our first chance to take a look at Teddy's scorecard here is round number four is underway. Banks in control so far, two rounds to one. Still anybody's fight. I think he's been the busier guy, though. Yeah, he has been the busier guy. And also, he's been the better real estate agent. You know, location, location, location. He's been in the right position for his style. He's been in tight. In and out. In and out. Wow, what an uppercut. Nice work on the combination by Banks. Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counterpunch opportunities because he's got an opponent who's walking in a little bit. Now he has a chance to start to chuck something back at him a little. Scores well to the belt line again. Bad 
intentions is scoring with that right hand. <laughs> Come on, Super two punch combo by bad intentions. And the life is only up two. What the fuck happened? After blocking that shot. Hey, swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That Bruh. punch was nowhere near his opponent. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Bro, how is that shit landing? Avoiding that punch. Ten seconds to go in the fourth. That shit is annoying. He got me that wrong. What has been a very entertaining fight. A fight where there's just bad attention. <sighs> this nigga do not go away, bro. Not he doing the wiggle on me either. That shit crazy. I got, why my stand so fucking low? All right, come on. Let me tighten up because he back up after everything. I know this, but I'm still throwing extra punches. Back underway here to live fight action. Tough to score. Very, very even. Closely contested bout throughout. Able to block that away. It was targeted for his head. That straight right unable to connect. That's a good block by Banks. Lands flush with the two punch combo by bad intention. Teddy, he did a smart thing right there. Just created enough space and then landed the counter punch. Looked like the will of the wisps, the old great Willie Peck. Made him miss, made him pay. 90 seconds to go here in this round. Blocks the headshot. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Oh my god. Of a very good counter punch. This fight is being fought at a pace that is beyond belief, Teddy. Well, this shows you what's great about human beings. Boom, left hand comes home. Bad intentions is. Bro, come on, bro. Why I'm hitting this nigga so many fucking times, bro? Come on, bro. God damn. Them was all power shots, bro. <laughs> Why I gotta hit you so much, bro? That's crazy. I'm scared, y'all. I don't think there's any doubt about that. But not by a wide enough margin where he can't accomplish the task at hand. His corner's letting him know that. You can just tell. There's the combo to the body. Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Keep your back up the room. Keep your back up the room. Take a walk. Turn fire that time. 
A headshot blocked. Bad intentions has got to figure out a way to do something different here. I mean, I know he's committed to being a counterpuncher, but right now he's giving rounds away. Yeah, he is because he's waiting for things to happen that are not happening. You know, he's, he's laying back, he's waiting for the guy to walk in. See, to be a good counterpuncher, an effective counterpuncher, guy has to come close to you. But his opponent's staying at a distance. He's not giving him anything to counter. Oh, that's a big shot with the left hand. Bro, your mind's up too high. Your <sighs> Turn the mind off. He was a mile like a motherfucker. It'd be like that, man. I got him out of here. I packed his ass up, bro. Let's check these punch stats, bro. Bro, I'll be killing them with the body punches, bro. Too many. He was made out of granite, bro. Hey, y'all, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, though. I'm out of here, though. I'm tired. I'm hot. Till next time, deuces, y'all. I appreciate y'all pulling up. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button for real, for real, deuces.